Hey guys, what is up and good morning. I have started off today pretty slowly, but this has been the first time that I've kind of had a day where I could start it off pretty slowly. Um, and I'm really happy. I'm very relaxed and cozy. As you guys can see, I'm wearing my plaid shirt and I literally wore this to bed last night and slept in it and it was very nice. Also, my hair, my whole aesthetic right now is great. I look like a messy hipster kid, but anyways, I have my coffee here. You guys saw the mug that I picked out. Let me know, this is something I've been wanting to do, is like in, I'm thinking Vlogmas, I really want to have like a set kind of morning thing for Vlogmas, and I want to like get up in the morning, um, I want to pick out a coffee mug with you guys so you guys will be able to see every single mug each morning. I kind of want to try to do a different mug every single day and I might have to count the amount of mugs that I have because I might not have 31 mugs. Well, I guess I'd only do it until the 20. Usually you vlog up to Christmas, which is the 25th, but I like to vlog Boxing Day too because in Canada... We go shopping on Boxing Day and it's a good time. That's like my, literally my favorite time ever. I love that. So um, I usually vlog up until Boxing Day. So the last day that a vlog will go up is the 27th to see the 26th, if that makes sense. So I'll have to make sure that I have 26 mugs. I might have to buy some new mugs. <laughs> but anyways, I really want to get up every morning in Vlogmas pick out a mug with you guys. Um, I have a few different um, advent calendars. and I actually watched a video from Fleur de Force. She did an unboxing of all of, not really the unboxing, but she showed the top 10 advent calendars. And I am so freaking tempted. They're like beauty calendars. Um, I do have two sticker advent calendars, but they're only 12 day ones. So I'm thinking about going back and forth between the two up until Christmas, um, but I was looking at advent calendars and I'm so tempted to get the Diptyque advent calendar, beauty calendar, because I've been wanting just a Diptyque candle for so long and apparently in their advent calendar, you get 16 candles, but they're like little mini ones. So I was going back and forth. I'm like, I either, the set that I wanted, there's like a Diptyque three candle set it's about $150, which is so expensive for candles, but I just love the aesthetic of them and just you guys see Diptyque candles in so many different like sticker kits, trendy posts on Instagram and Pinterest and stuff. I just really like the aesthetic of them. So I really wanted that like set of three, they're full size candles for $150. Or I could get the advent calendar that I think has 16 mini candles one of them being like a slightly larger mini candle, but it's not like they're full size candles. And then there's also like fragrances and I think that might be it. Cause I don't know what else Diptyque makes, but that is, I believe $300, which is a little bit expensive. And I'm pretty sure they don't sell them in Canada. So I'd have to purchase it somewhere else and then get it delivered to Canada. But I really want to like open my advent calendars every morning and pick out a mug with you guys and just have like a set little morning schedule of the vlog so you guys can kind of expect like same kind of footage every single day like in the morning obviously every single day is going to be different but i'm really excited let me know if you guys want me to do that also let me know if you think i should get the diptyque advent calendar or if i should just get the normal three pack so I really want the one that says roses, so I can put that down in the planning roses office because that'd be pretty sick. But anyways, I've been editing the vlog. It's currently 10 o'clock. My vlog's exporting. I'm gonna get that up, and then we're heading downstairs to start designing for the day. Like I told you guys, I'm probably going to be sitting at my computer all day, and this is probably how I'm going to look all day. So I'm gonna stop yapping. I'm gonna finish my coffee. Um, I have been eating just my brioche buns for breakfast this morning, but I am thinking I might actually make a legit breakfast. I might have a banana or I might make oatmeal and put banana in it, but yeah, I'm gonna go and then I will see you guys later. Hey guys, what is up? It's not that much later and <laughs> literally I'm still in the same spot. 
my videos still exporting. So um, I actually remembered while I was on here, I was answering some emails and stuff. And I remembered that yesterday when I went to the post office, I picked up a few things in my PO box. And guys, I'm so excited. I got two packages, one being a package that has a few things in it. This is from Diana of Control Alt Kauai. And if you did not see, I think I unpackaged some of her stickers in a vlog. And I think, I cried. I'm not sure. I've cried like twice from people sending me stickers because people are so sweet and they send me like custom stickers of things that I say in my vlogs and like, oh, I just, I can't. Like Diana, you are so friggin' sweet. And um, there's also someone else. I forget what her name was, but she was from Little Bear and Me. You guys are so friggin' sweet. But anyways, I'm going to unpackage these. The first one, like I said, is from Diana. And she said that she sent a few things as a thank you for mentioning her shop. No friggin' way. Girl! No, no. Oh no, don't fall, don't fall. Oh my goodness. I love it. Guys, it has a rose on it and it says heartbreaker, which <laughs> Wish I was a heartbreaker, but I don't know about that one. Um, but ah, uh, thank you so much. I love this. It's so cute. It's gonna be so cute for winter time. Thank you so much, Diana. And then, guys, I think she got Penny a Halloween costume, which, fun fact, I haven't got Miss Penny a Halloween costume. So this is gonna be perfect. Miss Penny, why are you hiding? Look at Penny, you can be a jack-o'-lantern. Can I put it on you? She's like, nah, mom, I'm gonna stay underneath this, this chair. But oh my goodness, thank you so much, Diana. And then she also sent me some stickers, which she sent me more Jenna's Journey stickers, which girl, I need these for editing. Oh, so excited. And then, ooh, yes, girl. She's, she's gotten on the photo, the photo kit wagon. So we got a photo kit called Merry Xmas. And this one has like a bunch of Christmas, Christmassy photos. This one is friggin' cute. This is the Hello Winter kit. It has like a bunch of wintry, that dog though. That's the kind of dog that my brother wants. He really wants a Husky. And then, ooh, I love this clip art. I was so, t oh, I love all of these. Girl, you gotta stop. Oh my goodness. This one is called Winter Wonderland and I loved this clip art because it was really cool, um, like contrast between geometric stuff and really cutesy stuff. I don't know if you guys can see, but this one here has like the cool geometric background and I just think it is absolutely stunning and, oh. I'm so excited. And then she also sent me a kit with this clip art, which I really, really like this clip art. This was from TWG Designs, and I was tempted to use it in my shop, but I just saw that a lot of shops were using it, so I decided to pass. But I'm so excited to have a kit with this. I'm so excited. Thank you so, so much, Diana. You are so sweet. You did not have to send me all this but just know that I appreciate it so, so much. Go up, go check out her shop, guys. She has amazing kits. She also has amazing, cute item stickers, character stickers, and like, thank you so much for the sweater. And I'm going to put this on Penny sometime during this vlog, so get ready, because she's gonna be the cutest little jack-o'-lantern, jack-o'-lantern you've ever seen. And then I also got uh, she did send me a note, which I will read that after. Maybe I should read it now. So I just read the note, and thank you so much, Diana. You are so friggin' sweet. And I struggle with the fact that Canada does not have Target. Like, we need it back. Target, please. Hello, Target. Please come back to Canada. But anyways, the second um, little thing I have here is from Kimmy's Studio. And... I'm gonna show you guys what I got in here. I'm excited to see. 
Is anyone like horrible at opening stuff? Because I am horrible at it. And guys, no freaking way. So cute. Okay, so this is from Kimmy's studio and she sent me a kit. Just wait guys, I'm wearing the perfect, perfect shirt for this. Perfect shirt for this. I love, oh, so cute. <gasps> Look it, it's plaid, I love plaid. It's so cute. <sighs> yes girl, Oh. This is probably the cutest Christmas kit I've ever seen in my life. Oh my God. Thank you so much. Um, I think your name is Kimmy, yes. Thank you so much, Kimmy. You are so sweet. I believe you have sent me something before, so thank you so much. You guys are so friggin' sweet. I love you. Oh, I just can't. Okay, so I just read the note, and thank you so much, Kimmy. You are so friggin' sweet, and I wish you all the success with your business. Oh, I just can't. Go check out both of these shops, guys. One is Kimmy's Studio, and the other is Control Alt Kauai. Thank you so much, girls. You are so friggin' sweet. I am going to upload this vlog finally and not vlog upload yeah this vlog yesterday's vlog the one that you saw yesterday while you're watching this one what anyways i'm going to stop yapping to you guys i've been sitting here for way too long i'm going to upload yesterday's vlog and i'll see you guys later just casually creeping on mom what are you doing Are you a pumpkin? Are you a jack-o'-lantern? <laughs> I love your costume. Look at you. Oh, you showing it off? You looking great? She said, yes, girl. Yes, girl. I'm looking good. What, what are you eating? <laughs> you look so cute. You look so cute. Yeah, you look so cute. Hey guys, what is up? It is quite a bit later. I think it's about 20 after. Oh, well that was a failure, Miss Penny. <laughs> she tried to jump up on the couch. But, um, what was I saying? It's about 5.20 right now, and <laughs> my arm gets so sore while vlogging. Okay, like I said, it's about 5.20 right now, and if you guys can hear in the background, I am defrosting my ground or minced turkey, ground turkey? Is that the same thing? I don't know, but I'm making sloppy joes. Like I told you guys, I really want sloppy joes. I've been craving them and I've never had them with turkey before. So I'm gonna try that out. Miss Penny is here. She's had a very relaxing day. How's your day been? Good? Has it been very good? You've been uh, sleeping, you, you slept, you uh, chewed on your chewy. Yeah, that was a good time. We played with your green ring. Your ring? Where's your ring? Hmm? Where's the ring? Anyways, I have finished both the vertical kit and the horizontal kit of the second collection. And I actually did a sneak peek on my Facebook group of the full boxes and oh my God, guys. The collection is called Marry Everything because the quote is Marry Everything and a Happy Always, which I think is a very fitting quote it's very Christmassy because technically it's Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year but really why don't we wish everyone a merry everything and a happy always like just because it's Christmas doesn't mean that's the only time that you can be thankful and spend time with your family and be happy obviously Christmas is a fun time but we should always feel like the holidays you know what I mean I hope you guys know what I mean, but you should always feel like it's the holidays. You should always be as happy as you are around Christmas, but I do admit Christmas is pretty awesome. Anyways, I am taking a break, obviously, from designing. I'm making dinner. My microwave's done, so I can stop yapping to you guys. I'm going to go make some dinner. I'll show you my end results of my Sloppy Joes, which really it's not going to be that appealing. Literally, Sloppy Joes. So I will see you guys later.
Okay guys, so this is the finished product. Like I told you guys, not the best looking thing in the world, but I've been craving one of these for so long. And turkey um, is supposed to be better for you than, you know, beef. So yeah, normally this would be made with like ground beef, but ground turkey it is. <laughs> Hey guys, what is up? It is a lot later. It is currently 11.37. It's actually not as late as I have gone to bed the last few nights, but I'm thinking I might quickly edit this vlog tonight because I've been thinking of everything that I need to get completed within tomorrow and I think I'll have like maybe three hours on Saturday to do a few things but just the amount of things that I have to do tomorrow basically um, I do want to go to the gym I want to try to go to the gym in the morning but I don't know if that's going to happen normally the gym comes second to Etsy if I have anything to do with my shop usually I try to do that first over the gym so that's why I didn't end up going to the gym tonight. Originally I was going to go tonight, but I had too much to do. Um, good news though is that I finished designing both of the pre-sale collections, and then I also designed four or five functional sheets, which is awesome, and that's why I haven't talked to you guys for a really long time. I also went and walked Penny, grabbed my Happy Mail, which I got um, my order from My Newest Addiction, which is an Etsy shop that I am obsessed with. Her designs freaking gorgeous and she like does them herself and I'm obsessed but anyways tomorrow um, I want to go to the gym I need to have a shower because I did have a bath last night but I did not wash my hair after and my hair's just been up in a bun for the last two days and it just is looking bad so I'm really sorry that you guys have to deal with this right now but also I think my exposure is up yeah I turned it up when I was cooking there we go that's better so um, I want to have a shower, I need to get this vlog up, um, I need to finish designing all the functional stickers. I printed all of the collections, I haven't printed the functional stickers yet, so I almost had a bad word in there. Functional stickers. <laughs> so I have to finish printing out everything, I need to cut everything, film that video, edit that video, upload that video, do the pictures, do the listings. I also need to film my mystery kit video, edit that video, upload that video, and then sometime in there I would love to be able to film a main channel video, like for this channel, that's not a vlog, but I honestly don't think I'm going to be able to, and it breaks my heart because, like, I love filming main channel videos, and I have a few ideas that I wanted to do, and I've told you guys many times that my Etsy shop does come before YouTube, so it kind of sucks, but you guys still are getting this vlog here, so it's not like you're going without a video today. But anyways, we're going to answer a few questions. I really do want to get this edited tonight, so I only think I'm going to answer like maybe two questions. But first, quick shout out to Shannon Youngblood. She said, hey Jenna, I've been a silent watcher for a while and I love watching your videos and your stickers are absolutely gorgeous. And thank you so much for commenting, Shannon. I appreciate it. And thank you for being a silent watcher. All of you silent watchers out there, and if you don't even comment, I don't care. I appreciate you just watching. So thank you so much. I appreciate it. And I think the first question um, I have seen this question a few times, and it's from Purple Sparkles with three Zs, and she said, Would you please do a How to Be Successful on Etsy video or series? Try to be first, but they beat me to it, lol. I would really love to do a whole series on that, but I feel like I've really answered a lot of those types of questions, how to be successful and do all the things um, in like my Q&As and stuff, so I feel like I'd just be repeating myself. So if you want to really learn about like how to be successful and what I feel um, goes into having a successful Etsy shop, definitely go check out all of my Q&As and stuff. I always answer those types of questions in my Q&As, so yeah. Okay, so the last question I'm going to answer is from Alex J, and he or she asked, 
I was wondering how often you post your vlogs when it is not Vlogween or Vlogmas. Are they posted weekly or is there not really a schedule or something like that? So before I started doing Vlogween, it was weekly. And basically with my weekly vlogs, I don't necessarily vlog every single day. It just depends on which days I'm busier and which days I'm not. You guys will notice, um, you probably noticed these last few vlogs has been a lot more of just me talking to you guys and like majority of the vlog is this ending portion where I'm ending with like answering your guys' questions and stuff because when I'm working all day and when I'm sitting at a computer designing, like there's really not a ton for me to vlog and to show you guys. So those kind of vlogs or those kind of days when I did my weekly vlogs, they were just skipped and then you know, the more amusing days are the ones that I actually vlog. So when I get back onto a weekly schedule, which is going to be in November, that's what I'm going to be doing. And then obviously in December, I'm going to be going back to daily, which I'm really excited about, but slightly excited to have a little bit of time off in November. I still will be vlogging, but it's not going to be like editing and uploading every single day, which I have like a newfound respect for daily vloggers because it's really hard, and especially when I am not only doing this, I also have my Etsy shop, I have the Planning Roses YouTube, I have, you know, main channel videos, which unfortunately I can't do one this week, but yeah, it gets to be a lot, and I'm getting stressed, but it's okay, I'm good, I always pull through, and somehow I do it all. I don't know how, but... Anyways, I am going to end the vlog here. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you're not already subscribed, please do that. I'd appreciate it so, so much. If you're already subscribed, thank you so much for subscribing. Also remember to comment down below any questions you guys have. If I did not answer your question yet, then definitely comment it again and I will be sure to answer it. And I love you guys so much. And I will see you guys in the next vlog, which is tomorrow. In the Bye guys. When I wake and the sun is coming through, oh you feel my lungs are sweet now.